Good evening everyone, Mike AD0CZ here. Wanted to uh, show you guys all a little modification I made. Uh, for a while now I've been looking for a good pair of uh, headset uh, to be able to use uh, a good headset on my uh, on my radio, my TS2000. And uh, I think we can all agree that high aisle microphones are, are wonderful. They're also uh, beautifully expensive and you can kind of almost only use them on the radio. Um, I also want to be able to use a headset on my PC. Uh, so what I did was I decided to turn uh, a pair of computer headsets into uh, an amateur radio headset. And I thought I'd show you guys how I did that. Uh, I borrowed a, a couple schematics that I found online. I'll show you a copy of it here. Uh, the short version is we're using the uh, standard computer headset uh, to on your tip and on your sleeve here on the right. Um, biased by the Kenwood's 8 volts uh, on the pin 8 uh, through a resistor and then uh, a DC blocking capacitor to feed the audio back to the microphone and then tie the ground on. Pretty darn simple circuit and while originally I was thinking about building a box uh, to be able to house this uh, simple circuit and have a couple of connectors and jacks I realized that uh, why reinvent the wheel? I had sitting next to me a uh, Kenwood uh, MC60, I want to believe it's called, uh, the standard desktop mic from uh, from back in the day, and it already had all of the connections on the microphone cable, and everything was uh, already wired in and patched in. So, if I can uh, find a good way to tap into that cable, I can probably kill two birds with one stone. I don't have to redo all the buttons. I can still have a desktop mic when I want to use it, but when I want to use a headset, I can do so. So what I did was I grabbed a uh, cable here with this is a, a quarter inch uh, standard microphone to a quarter inch jack uh, here and this is essentially what would have been a micro or a headset extension cable routed it up put a little hole in the back of the uh, the desk mic and then routed that cable into my little simple circuit uh, what I did is I attached to those uh, pin uh, pin 7 and pin 1 connectors uh, and pin 8 connectors essentially where they would go onto the uh, th um, through the connector jumper them on right under the board and then uh, off it goes the audio goes through that uh, circuit and then on through the cable into my radio just did a quick audio check on the local repeater and uh, the signal report I had was sounded like I was standing in the room next to him so I thought uh, some of you other fellow hams might uh, like to see how you went about going to attach a standard computer headset onto your ham radio through a simple circuit so uh, I will post more comments or uh, more information on this on the uh, comments of the video uh, feel free to uh, ask any questions if you have any uh, 73's this is Alpha Delta Zero Charlie Zulu